in addition to the very interesting bedrock we have here at Marshalls Beach, we can look away from the water toward the sea cliffs and we see landslides, which are very characteristic of our coastline and a number of other places uh, where we have topography and gravity will cause the failure of slopes and the movement of material downhill. So this can be uh, dependent on a number of factors as to where we have them, but it's influenced, for example, by the type of rock. So some types of rock are weaker than others, such as this deformed serpentinite here, which is why the cliffs are green, because they're made of this serpentinite. If we look up to the skyline, we'll see uh, a set of cliffs up high. Those are actually bedrock. The material below that, what we call the headscarp, has moved down toward the beach. So it results in topography that's very lumpy. We call it hummocky topography. So if we look to the top of the, of the cliffs here, we get a good three-dimensional view of a landslide. The cliffs at the top are the headscarp. That's the bedrock below which material has moved down the slope. It has a sort of a curved shape. And in three dimensions, that upper part of the landslide is concave. OK, so it's like this. Whereas where material has piled up after having moved down the slope, it's convex, right? like this. We can see that at the bottom of the slope. So when we look at these features along the coastline, ignore the vegetation. The vegetation is simply growing on the landform, which is what we're really looking at. We're really just looking at the three-dimensional nature of the surface of the Earth here. Now these landslides are promoted in addition to the bedrock type, the orientation of weakness in that bedrock, uh, by other conditions. Here, coastal erosion is accelerated by rising sea level. We are at a high sea level stand now, and sea, sea level is rising still further. This, of course, threatens structures and other things on the, that are built near these sea cliffs. So we have buildings and roads, houses that are menaced by these coastal landslides. 